racism in the heartland. Over the weekend, there was an incident down south of where I live in a place called Lake Monroe. And obviously, it's a lake. Um, lots of boating, swimming, yada, yada, yada down there, right? Now, a lot of the lake front property is you know rich rich people but there was a group of people that were down there and for a for a party or something like that with a big group of people and they were going through some woods to get down to where the party was well a group of gentlemen who were uh, inebriated decided that they wanted to stop these people from trespassing. Problem was, is one, the guys had no authority. It wasn't their property. Two, it wasn't private property from what I've been able to uh, ascertain. And three, the guys decided to go full redneck hillbilly racist and started calling because there was one uh, there was one black guy with a group. I think it was like if I remember right, it was like five or six uh, five or six people all together, and started you know just going full blown stupidity, and actually ended up assaulting the guy with one guy saying somebody grab a noose. So these guys were basically going to try to lynch this guy. It's pretty freaking sad. Now I'll, I'll uh, post all the, the videos right here. Stop it. Stop. Let him go. You're coming with you are so funny. Stop. You're doing Let him go. Stop. We're just trying to get out of here, guys. We're just trying to get out of here. Let him go, dude. Let him go. Let him go. Please let him go. Please let him go. We're going to as soon as you let him go. I'm going to. Gotta get the fuck out of here. Let him go. Get your phones out of here and go. Let him go. Shake your head at me. Let him go. Get the fuck out of here. In a Star Wars. You're worse than okay. the place. You happy about this? We're totally worse than the place. Please send me back You happy about this? You fucking nappy headed bitch. You happy about this? What do you really want to call me? Do it. You nappy headed bitch. What do you want to call me? about this? You with your five white friends? You happy with your five white friends? You guys, you guys started all this shit. Fuck totally you, put it in your fucking one. film, bitch. You, you film it. Film it all. Fuck you. Power. Come over here again. Go our own way. Go. Go. Guys. Come over here again. Film it. This sucks. This sucks both ways, guys. Come over here again. This sucks both ways. No, no, no. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Von, let's go. Yeah, I know. Just like I know you were when you came down and invaded us. Just like you guys invaded us. You guys invaded us. You guys invaded us. Yeah. We were having a great time and you invaded no us. You invaded no one invaded you. You stupid okay. fucking liberal fucks. Bring it back. Bring That's bring what you back. get. <laughs> Take your ass on. Bring it back. What's on? Right Are you okay? Now you saw with all those videos what these guys were their aim was. Their aim was to hurt or kill this guy. Based solely on his race. Now, I don't care if you're white, black, brown, yellow, purple, pink, fuchsia. No one deserves 
to either A, have this done to them, or B, do it to somebody else. This is just absolutely asinine that we as a freaking human race can't respect each other enough that people act like this. I don't freaking get it, folks. I don't. Have we not grown as a society that we still think that one group is better than another based solely upon the pigment uh, that they have on their skin or their gender or their religion nationality anything no what makes you who you are is a combination of all of the above and that does not ever make you better or worse than someone else if there's ever such a way it is your actions that is what speaks volumes everything else is superficial at best now, I posted a couple videos over the weekend which I think got me on uh, the YouTube naughty list because my uh Last video only got like five views. Uh, about the Stone Mountain, Georgia stuff. With the uh, NFAC. Uh, the Not Fucking Around Coalition. I've been doing a little more, uh, a little more research into them. I do have one guy who is uh, threatening me. Don't, don't really appreciate that. But... I've got a couple others that are engaging in a very civil and respectable conversation, which I do appreciate. We're, if you live here in the U.S., we're all Americans. Let's act like it. If you don't live in the U.S., if you live in wherever, we're all humans act like it. No one deserves to be treated less based upon who they are. That's all I got for you.